This morning, gas in the tri-state still teetering around the 450 mark as we approach a big travel weekend. WCPO 9 News reporter Ali Kramer joins us live off I-71 in Hyde Park with a look at gas prices and some advice from experts on maybe how to save a few bucks this weekend. Ali? Yeah, and Julie, you know what I always kind of watch is an intersection that has multiple stations because they compete with one another and sometimes kind of edge each other out by a cent or two. You know I'm always stopping at the cheaper one. That's usually the case at the Shell and the BP right at the intersection of Madison and Edwards. So just off 71, busy travel area. 449 at Shell, it's the exact same right across the street at BP. You are not going to be getting a deal out here. We checked out gas prices in the overnight hours to kind of see where we were compared to the national average. Uh, 454 is what we saw in Covington. That's probably one of the highest in the area between that and Evanston and Camp Washington. Right now, high gas prices are being driven by at least two things, the cost of crude oil and the summer travel season where gas is in higher demand. AAA experts say some people are, well, most people rather, are still traveling, but maybe they're not going as far. Maybe they don't stay as long, or maybe you choose to eat in instead of going out every night. It's all about balancing out the overall budget for the trips now that gas is eating up more of it. But Kara Hitchens with AAA says there are some small things you can do to save money, like making sure your vehicle is as fuel efficient as possible. Making sure that your car is running well. You know, you wanna make sure that, you know, you have pro proper tire inflation so that it's connecting with the road. You know, you wanna make sure that your air filter and your oil filters are working properly and been changed as well. So those things can help your car run well um, we tell people limit the use of the air conditioner because that eats up fuel as well. A lot of people don't realize that. But if you're just driving around town, roll down your windows and enjoy the fresh air. Okay, today is the perfect morning to tell you to roll your windows down and enjoy the fresh air. But the humid, hot summer months when gas is still going to be this high, uh, not really an option here in the Cincinnati area. You're going to be dying for the air conditioning. Uh, will gas prices tip up above $5 before Memorial Day? Experts are saying no, probably not here in the tri-state, but that's a real possibility for the summer months. I even read this morning upward to six dollars a gallon so maybe we're thankful for what we've got now if you kind of are thinking about how bad it could get for now reporting live in hyde park ali kramer wcpo 9 news